ओम श्री गणेशाय नम ओम श्री गुरुभ्यो नम All of us today have vehicles, whether it's our uh, starting from a cycle, a kid having a cycle, or it's a two-wheeler, or a four-wheeler, a dream car, whatever it is. We all have vehicles, most of us. And when we have vehicles, the first thing we do when we buy a vehicle is go to a temple, get prayers done, we do puja and everything. And then after that, we don't really do anything other than on the Ayut Puja day where we have the tradition of washing our vehicles and cleaning it up thoroughly and then doing puja and prayers for that that is during the dasara but other times during the year many times what happens is that we don't really pay so much attention to how to maintain our vehicles uh, through the energy point of view we all have god's photos inside our cars and we do keep flowers most of them i know do that they have a very good habit and then uh, you know they pray like this before uh, starting the car in or the two wheeler and uh, they it's more like a habit mechanically your hand goes and then you touch the steering wheel and then you pray and or you do this and then you start your vehicle you do that that's fine it's a very good practice but many times what happens is that you know your car goes on many uh, you know you drive and you don't even realize that there may be probably a lemon which was uh, thrown away you know especially shopkeepers they remove the drishti or the buri nazar and uh, they literally throw the lime and the chilies on the road especially where three roads meet the three road junction and some people break eggs because they want to remove the nazar buri nazar and then again where three roads meet they just throw it there and go and sometimes you end up driving on that and then so obviously you would have picked up the negative energy in the car and you don't realize it if it's not severe but if it's very severe what really happens is that you would have parked your vehicle somewhere somebody will come and hit the vehicle or you'll have some boy or a sm- small child coming and scratching your vehicle your car and unnecessarily trying to tear the seat so the vehicle is disturbed basically and uh, you attract these kind of things these kind of situations so then uh, i also i mean at one point of time even i had this experience where i would simply have parked my vehicle in the parking lot somebody will come and just touch it and there's a dent or you end up uh, having accidents so i mean for me what used to happen is every time i'm just parking it in one place somebody will come and hit or some kid will come and scratch or something or the other was happening sometimes even i would go in certain way where you know people would keep coming in front of me suddenly you know and you have to apply sudden brakes and things like that i'm not talking about driving skills i'm not talk- talking about traffic what i'm saying is unsavory instances happen when you have picked up those negative uh, energies because your your movement in the car and uh, sometimes you, what happens you drive your friends around and things like that if they are uh, have if they have attracted something negative it just and they sit in your car it sometimes gets transferred it all depends everything is about energy and how subtle you are with these energies so in that case what is it that you need to do if you feel even little bit things are not okay uh, you are simply getting hurt for no reason like physically i'm saying you you suddenly you trip and you fall something or the other keeps happening so you know oh it's not okay and suddenly i have even heard people who will keep their fingers in where they close the door at the door and they the hand gets jammed uh, so unsavory instances related to vehicles injuries in the vehicle all of this accidents mishaps you know all these things if they happen what is it that you need to do first thing you do is please take it to a ganesha temple with go with the vehicle tell the purohit or the pujari there to do prayers for the vehicle and remove the nazar by breaking a coconut so especially everywhere in south india we have this tradition i'm not sure about north you can check but uh, we here break coconut so that is the best way to remove the negative energy for the vehicle whatever the vehicle has accumulated whatever drishti many times what happens nobody would have done anything your car is gone on gone on anything negative or any negative energy but since you bought a new car and people observe that you are moving around in the car and you know that can also attract negativity and jealousy that can also create problems so even then if you just go yourself and you know, to the temple pray to ganesha tell uh, the pujari to clear the negativity of the vehicle or whatever is caused because of the vehicle because vehicles are something which is very evident 
you know you go on the road people will observe and people who have seen you day in and day out they see you with the vehicles and uh, moving around they whether you are stylish or not they will have 100 things in their mind that can also have an impact in a negative way so best thing to do is this so periodically you get this done once in 3 months once in 6 months depending on how you are feeling uh, some people if they feel it's too much uh, you know it's happening more often i'm getting more hurt i'm get bumping into others i'm not able to drive properly there was no reason for accident i ended up in one uh, you know all of that then you please get it done more often i know people who will be just go driving well they're excellent drivers and some cycle fellow will come and hit them and there was no reason for him to hit he hit uh, i have seen people who are uh, going slow in the signal and when there's a red signal somebody else will come very fast and bang your car from behind so i mean th- these kind of things happen for no fault of yours most of the times that's when you know it's the energy it's not your driving skills so then you need to do this and clear your energy so uh, try this try this out be safe on the road and uh, you know enjoy your drive or ride let it not become a headache or let it not become a problem let it not uh, be a pro- uh, be a magnet for you to attract problems of different kinds i mean it's uh, it's it's so sometimes funny but at the same time i understand that it's crazy that people are now attracting problems from all quarters i mean you name it and it's there so it's like uh, people are getting innovative in terms of even attracting problems so i'm i'll have to i mean that's so much more learning for us that yeah okay through problems we get to know uh, you know what is the kind of problems people face and then what is the solution for that keeping your car clean and everything is fine in terms of hygiene point of view but energy also needs to be clean so this uh breaking coconut is very good it's very very effective i have tried it personally even i used to go through these rough patches you know sometimes i used to attract this kind of negativity i would just go to ganesha temple my guru told me to do this actually and it's really effective so and there the priest would break coconut and next minute things are fine you know you nothing as if nothing went wrong at all so it immediately neutralizes the negativity it doesn't let the negativity get to your being and affect your activities okay i wish you all the best drive safe namaste mm-hmm.